starting Monday, the department will not respond to calls that are not in progress unless officers will be on the night watch. Good evening and thank you for making us a part of your Saturday. I'm Alexandra Todd filling in for Erica. Tonight we're talking to people about the new changes Pittsburgh police are implementing. Kitty Gay's Mamie Ba reports. Mixed reaction from residents here. Some welcome the changes and believe they will be good for the city. Others believe more patrols should be out at night. The whole city of Pittsburgh uh, is, is at risk. Rich Chubka, the owner of this business on the south side, isn't too happy about the new changes being implemented by Pittsburgh police in just a few days. It's terrible that they are decreasing the police force. 27 officers will patrol the city overnight, not accounting for any call-offs. Also, the department will not respond to any calls that are not in progress. They will go to an enhanced telephone reporting unit or online reporting. I think that a lot of the calls that come in can be handled through the telephones as they're proposing it. But I, I just have concerns that there just aren't enough police officers According to Pittsburgh city leadership, the modifications are based on data. Pittsburgh Police Chief Larry Scarado said in a news conference Friday, he understands all won't welcome the changes, but it's for the betterment of everyone. I'm confident in the decisions that we make that it impacts this bureau and the city in a much better way than we have in the past. Others we spoke with welcome the restructuring and are most pleased about Pittsburgh Police Cares, a new initiative that plans to build police and community relations. Yeah, I like that, you know, get involved. You know, I'm glad that they're, you know, doing something different. Also part of the changes for 10 hour days work week for officers. Reporting from downtown Pittsburgh, Mamie Ba, KDKA TV News.